Hi everyone, Dr. Brian Stein here at Wilkins Spinal Care in Mount Pleasant. This week's blog we talked about acute pain versus chronic pain and it is a vicious battle. So not only chiropractors but all medical professions fight between acute pain and a chronic pain. What is acute pain? What is chronic pain? Acute pain is when pain first starts. Chronic pain is when that acute pain started and it just kept getting worse and worse and worse. I'm going to explain a little bit today how to identify what is acute pain, what is chronic pain, and what it all entitles. So the first thing I want to talk about before I go into acute pain and chronic pain is I want to explain the term inflammation. So inflammation is when the body encounters an offending agent such as a virus, bacteria, toxic chemical, which creates an inflammatory cell response to take control of the immune system. Whenever we hurt ourselves, whether it's a small cut from your finger or a car accident, cells come in that have inflammation and just create everything. This helps increase the healing process. Without these cells, we can heal. So how do you determine if it's acute pain or if it's chronic pain? First thing, when someone has an acute pain, I can obviously have pain, whether it's a sharp pain, stiff pain, whatever. Swelling's usually entitled into it, redness around the area, and it's usually short term. Now this is where it becomes a little bit more of a problem. Some doctors say it's after three days it's considered chronic, some say it's as short as a few minutes, and some say as long as three to six months. It's a very, very, very heat topic between not only chiropractors, but everybody in a medical profession career. So chronic now. Chronic's pain, okay? Usually by this point, the swelling's gone, the redness is gone. It's more so just long-term pain that's greater than three to six months and so on and so forth. So how do you determine the difference? Like what kind of injuries cause acute pain? What type of injuries cause chronic pain? You know, acute pains are something like, you know, you fall off your bicycle, a cut on your finger. Um, those are all types of acute pain. Infections can be acute pain. But then whenever say you have a residual from infection or chemotherapy, the toxic chemicals up there, a virus, a bacteria that just isn't going away, that's when they consider a chronic pain. Now, this is kind of more so what chiropractors go through. Don't worry about the short term, long term. Here's how we look at it. As long as there is inflammation in the area, it is an acute condition. If there's inflammation flooding into the area, these cells are still bringing in responses, it is an acute phase situation. So time frame's really not the biggest thing. So what can we do to help? We treat acute patients and chronic patients the same exact way. It just depends on how their exam came out. Are they gonna be a chiropractic patient? Are they gonna be a decompression patient? Are they gonna be a neuropathy patient? If you're a neuropathy patient, typically at that point you're in a chronic situation. You know, most people who come into us with neuropathy have had it for 20 years. Yeah, for sure, that's a chronic situation. Now there's always a little bit of inflammation coming in, but it's been there for so long that yeah, it would be considered a chronic condition. Yes, those are things we help with our neuropathy service upstairs. Same thing with decompression. Some people that come into our office with disc bulges, disc herniations. Those are things that they may have had for years and years and years, and they weren't able to do anything our decompression service can help with that. Same thing with chiropractic, and that's the biggest thing we see is the chiropractic patients. Some patients come in from a fall, yeah, you're definitely in acute condition. Or some patients may have had a car accident 20 years ago, and yeah, that's a chronic condition. But we're able to manage those patients and get them better again. So that's all I have for you today on acute and chronic conditions. Um, if you have any questions on that or even inflammation, I don't have a specific blog on inflammation. I kind of just tied that into the acute and chronic uh, blog here. So if you have any questions on anything, feel free to give me a call. I'll be happy to answer any questions for you. Otherwise, we're going to have a nice warm week ahead of us. So people are going to start putting their gardens out, um, you know, starting to use the shovels a lot more. Get in here if you're getting hurt. So um, we can definitely help with that. And that would be a definite acute, acute condition. So. Everybody have a great rest of your day, and we'll see you in next week's video.